Tarek just announced LL Cool J is set to return as the host of the Grammys. This will be his fourth consecutive year as MC. Plus, more acts have been added to the All Star lineup. Here's Adam Wilde. Williams, Sam Smith, and Miranda Lambert will be performing on the Grammy stage. They are the latest hit makers just added to the show, which will also see John Legend and Common perform Glory, their Oscar nominated song from the movie Selma. The star studded lineup also includes already announced performances from Madonna and Ariana Grande. Catch the sights and sounds, plus the Entertainment City live at the Grammy's Red Carpet Show on February 8th here on City. With the countdown heating up for the 21st annual Screen Actors Guild Awards, the SAG statue is making the rounds in Hollywood. We'll be there when the hardware is handed out this weekend. Tune in Monday for the SAG highlights. It's no big deal. She's performed massive shows across the world, but it turns out the Super Bowl stage is a big deal for Katy Perry. When it comes to the Super Bowl, I feel like I've outdreamt my dream in such an incredible way. I don't get nervous about much, but I'll definitely be a little inside that day. Perry will be joined on stage by veteran rocker Lenny Kravitz during the February 1st halftime show. Wayne Gretzky is a grandpa. The Great One's daughter Paulina and her fiance Dustin Johnson welcome their first baby, a baby boy, on Monday. The baby's name is still a secret, but we do know one thing. The new mom has a strong network of family support. I have such a foundation of good supporters, you know, just normal, happy, strong family. For Entertainment City, I'm Adam Wilde. You can hear me on the Blake and Wilde show every day from 2 to 7 on KISS 92.5. Entertainment City, brought to you by Fallsview Casino Resort in Niagara Falls, the place you want to be.